just made it to H-E-B. About to just, you know, grab a few things for tonight. Um, yeah. I really don't feel like doing this, but you know, gotta get something to eat for the night. So, let's go. Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say. You said that you would come again. You said that we would remain friends, but you know that I do not depend on nothing or no one. So why would you show up so uninvited? Then just change my mind like that. Please don't take this personal. But you ain't shit. guys so i am back from heb and i'm about to go ahead and cook these tacos y'all i end up getting some charro beans as well because i really 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 like the charro beans i've never had that brand so i'm hoping that you know once i season them and everything like that it comes out good but yeah these good old tacos and charro beans about to hit tonight just a little snippet of my food yes y'all this shit was definitely hidden especially them chowder beans it's almost like i seasoned them things just right hey y'all i am back so um i done took my shower i done ate and yeah it's time for girl talk okay y'all let me grab my drink all right y'all so Pretty much girl talk is just right now because this is the October monthly reset. So I'm pretty much just going to be talking about what like what my October goals are going to be, the things I'm going to be doing for the month of October, the things that I might want to change um, for this month, etc, etc. Um, <clears throat> so like, honestly this whole vlog thing y'all is like completely new to me um in the past i have tried to vlog and stuff like that but i just never was consistent you know with it or whatever but i'm definitely now going to start being consistent with my vlogging with my lifestyle content with my beauty content with all my content really um so with that being said um we're gonna get into my 
October goals. So I have everything written down right here in my notebook. So if y'all see me looking down, that's why. But um, yeah, so my my monthly goals are um, number one is to uh, be more consistent. We was just talking about consistency. So yes, be more consistent. Um, whether it be with my social with my content on YouTube, my social media content like Instagram and Facebook and TikTok, or whether whether it be being consistent with like my workout regimen or eating healthy or just my uh spiritual journey with God, like literally being consistent with all of that, it basically entails all of that. Um and that that is one of the main things that I want to do is consistency. I'm not gonna lie, um, I tend to procrastinate a lot, and um, of course the first step is admitting, and I am admitting that I procrastinate a lot. So I do definitely need to stop the procrastination and just you know get to it, like get to the bag, get to the money, get to all of the things that um, I definitely want to do and just execute you know so that's mainly what i'm focused on is consistency for the month of october um also i want to start back reading books um when i was younger honestly i used to read a lot of books i used to write poems i used to do all kind of stuff y'all but um definitely reading books was my thing um i used to like a lot of the urban books you know like the um the authors like Eric Jerome Dickey and Zane and Sister Soldier. I mean, I remember my first book was The Coldest One Ever. That was my very first book I ever read. If any of y'all know what I'm talking about, but yeah, like I like urban books and um I also like other kind of books too, but mainly urban books and stuff like that. Um, so I definitely want to get back into reading. Um, I have some books. I have some books that I've been meaning to read. Honestly, my friend Roslyn, we were supposed to start like this um, book club. And she had gave me the three books that we were supposed to be reading for the book club. But I don't know what happened. But the book club never got started or whatever. Um, shout out to you, girl. Shout out to you, Rosalyn. If you are watching this, let's get that book club started, girl, because I am definitely ready to start reading some books now. I don't know if we're going to be reading the books that you gave me because I'm going to start reading them now. But back to what I was saying, y'all, the books that um, she gave me were, it's like a series. So it's three books. I'm going to show them to y'all real quick. So it's called the Banks Sisters. This is the first one. This the first one. And then the Banks Sisters 2. And then we have the Banks Sisters 3. And the author is Nikki Turner. And I'm not gonna lie, I had started uh reading the Banks Sisters. The first one and y'all I got like maybe one third through through the book or whatever and the book is damn good y'all I'm not gonna lie the book is good <laughs> for real and um but I don't know what happened I just stopped reading it or whatever the case may be life probably got to me who knows but I definitely want to start like making time to read books now um I'm definitely interested in reading I think it's a healthy habit to I mean I think it's a healthy hobby to have um you know where something that could just occupy your time in a positive way so um right now my daughter because she has like a little bookmark right here my daughter's reading reading the books too so she's reading the first one so once she's done with this first one i'm gonna back door and read it and then i'm gonna give her the second one and then it's so on and so on and we're gonna just do it like that but yeah that's like one of the books that I'm wanting to read. And then I have another book right here. It's called Fervent. Um, a Woman's Battle Plan for Serious, Specific, and Strategic Prayer. 
and this book is inspired by the war room now i don't know if you guys watched a movie called the war room if you haven't watched it go watch it it's a really 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 good movie um this book is by priscilla shire and here's the book right here And honestly, I've been bought this book, y'all. Like, that's why I be seeing I be procrastinating, man. Like, I've been bought this book, like, two years ago, probably. And I never read this book. Like, literally. And it's literally just been sitting in my closet. And I'm just like, you know what? Since I'm about to start back reading, I'm definitely... This is another book that I'm going to start reading. So, while my daughter is reading that first Bank Sisters series, part of the series... I'm going to be reading this book. I'll probably be done with this book by the time she's done with that one. So, yeah, I'm going to start reading this book, get that in. And, yeah, but that's another goal that I have for the month of October. Um, I definitely want to uh, just stay true to my exercise uh, goals, my body goals. I have body goals, y'all. I don't know if y'all see your girl, but your girl is, is thick, okay? I mean... I wasn't always thick, wasn't always thick, but I'm thick right now. And I feel like I'm a little too thick. Um, we're not going to say fat because I'm not fat, far from it. But your girl is thick and this is the thickest that I've ever been in life. And honestly, I just want to get down just a little bit, y'all. I need to, I, my goal is to lose a good 30 to 35 pounds I really honestly don't want to disclose my weight right now because it, man, come on, I don't want to disclose my weight, but I need to lose about a good 30, 35 pounds, 40 at the most. Um, I am going to start like a um, fitness vlog, like do some fitness vlogs and like what I eat in a day and stuff like that. I mean, I'm going to start doing those type of vlogs. So make sure y'all stay tuned if y'all interested in stuff like that. That way you guys can, you know, keep up with my weight loss journey. Because I'm definitely motivated to lose this weight. So this weight is coming off. So that's definitely a goal for the month of October. Is just to stay true to my exercise regimen, my exercise routine, and eat more healthier. You know, stay true to the diet that I'm on. Um, and also uh another the last goal that i have right now is basically to just uh uh do more self-care for myself like i'm not gonna lie like i do self-care don't get me wrong i do self-care but i don't do it a lot and i have a whole business y'all i have a whole small business called mona b collections where i sell body care products which is literally self-care i use i use my own products of course and my products are really good but i just want to start catering to myself i mean self-care is not just about the products that you use self-care to me is also taking care of your mind your body your spirit you know what i'm saying like literally taking care of yourself you know not saying you know be you know sometimes you got to be a little selfish you know what i'm saying and put yourself first because how can you care for others and do things for others and you and your yourself is not good so you have to always have self-care i haven't always been too good with self-care and um i definitely want to just start you know um my self-care journey starting this month just be more consistent with it um but yeah so that, those are my october goals um things that i want to change for the month of october i didn't really write these down so i'm kind of coming off the dome with it but uh like things i want to change for the month of october is definitely procrastination i'm i want to rid myself of procrastination for sure um what else do i want to change uh i want to change just uh thinking negatively um i definitely tend to worry a lot you know especially when things don't go my way so i want to change thinking negative to thinking about the positive things because the more positive that you think the more positive things that happen in your life um also something else that i want to change is 
Another thing I want to change, honestly, and this is just like something personal, but I don't mind telling y'all, it's just taking things so personally. Um, honestly, like people would say things to me or whatever, and I literally would take it personal and it would hurt my feelings, like literally taking it personal. I need to stop doing that. I really need to stop caring what people think, you know what I'm saying? And just do me, you know? I mean, I feel like I would have such a better life if I just stopped caring what people thought, you know, and literally just stop taking everything personal. So I'm working, I'm working on myself, y'all. And definitely patience. That's something else I want to change because I'm a very impatient person. It's like I expect things to happen right when I want them to happen or exactly the way that I want it to happen. And that's just not the way life works, y'all. And I know that. And so I definitely want to work on my patience as well so those are things that i want to work on um and i also just wrote down like some youtube video ideas or whatever um i'm not gonna disclose all of that right now i mean i just want y'all to go ahead and subscribe you know what i'm saying to your girl channel and once y'all subscribe y'all gonna see the videos that your girl about to put out like i said i'm working on being consistent y'all so I'm definitely going to be consistent. I promise y'all, I am working so hard to be more consistent. And, um, yeah, by the way, you guys, uh, me and my boyfriend, we do have a couple's channel called Monique and Byron, and it is in the description bar. So, uh, if you guys are not following our couple's channel, make sure you guys go to our couple's channel and follow it and subscribe. We will, we are starting back our channel back up and we're, like I said, with the consistency thing, I'm definitely, we're going to be very consistent on that channel as well. So if y'all like couples channels and stuff like that, make sure you guys subscribe to our couples channel as well. And, um, yeah, I also have like a, I have a business channel too for Mona B Collections too, but I don't, I haven't really been posting anything on there um but i don't know i think i'm gonna start back posting on there too i mean if y'all want to go follow that channel too y'all can it's really up to y'all but yeah i'm about to go ahead and end this video y'all because i got you know videos to edit i got like a lot of stuff to do a lot more stuff to do or whatever but i really do hope that you guys enjoyed this uh october monthly reset video and um like i said i know that my vlog isn't perfect you know but i'm definitely getting back into the swing of things and um things will my vlogs will start to look better or get better as time go on i'm a new i'm new to this vlogging thing so just just work with your girl just work with me but yes until the next video, peace and love, y'all. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say it, you want that bitch, put your hands up.